Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Today is currently the 26th or something of February. It is Wednesday and it is a college day for me today. So it is currently half eight and I do have a college call in half an hour. So I will have to go and have some breakfast and get ready for his call. But like literally, I've just woken up, hence why I sound um, really quiet and really like morning like talk you know what i mean and yes i do have a, a bag under my eyes as i could not get to sleep last night i don't think i have actually filmed the college morning routine so i think i'll do one um or i think i'll just like uh, make a vlog but like add this into the vlog i'm not quite sure yet um but i am quite hungry so i'm gonna go have some breakfast i'm really tired <laughs> i'm gonna go so the toilet, oh my god, I'm so tired. <laughs> like, I'm really not a morning person at all. But yeah, um, I'm gonna go to the toilet and have a wee and everything. And then I'm gonna go downstairs. Why is there like a wee mark on the windowsill? I don't know. Yeah, and then after that, I'll go and have a breakfast because I am starving. So yeah. So for breakfast, I'm gonna have some fresh orange juice right here. Um, I usually have it in a little glass. And then I think for breakfast today, I think I will actually just have a banana because I want to be healthy. Oh my god, and my eyes are always so small in the morning. Like, look at them. <laughs> but yeah, I am really tired. Oh, because I struggled to get to sleep last night, and um, I think I've only got to sleep at around like half twelve or something, which is really bad. But like, I couldn't help it. Um, but I'm just gonna get some orange juice now. Orange over apple any day. Who else agrees with me? because it's just so much nicer um but yeah i'm really not talkative in the morning so this morning part of the video will not be interesting at all but yeah i'm gonna go and have these now so i'm gonna go on my call soon it's currently almost for 10 to 9 so i'm just gonna set up my laptop for teams as we do do our our college calls on teams and today i'm gonna have a lesson nine until 12 so i do have half a day of college today but uh, my timetable is on a monday i have a lesson nine until 12 and then an hour break and then i do have a lesson one till four and on a tuesday it's the same again and then on wednesday i've just got half a day so it's pretty easy to be honest um like the timetable i mean <laughs> i have my glasses ready on my head so i will need them for looking at the computer screens i do have a bad eyes now <laughs> i love that for me but yeah i'm gonna set up teams it's already set up automatically on my laptop already so there's like my little timetable there i've been investing in a vlogging camera someday guys um i've been vlogging on my phone for a good few years now but like some vlogging cameras are so expensive i will eventually invest in one to know that the sound quality and the video quality will be so much better but for now we'll have to make do with my iphone for vlogging on so my college call is all done finally i think i was on the call for two and a half hours which is quite a long time to be on the call for with no break but i've now finished the call i've been in the shower i brushed my teeth i did exfoliate my arms and my legs as well because i did need a bit of an exfoliation plus i will be testing out a new bondi sand like everyday casual tan as did go to be an the other day and i did pick up these two which i'm just going to show you right now i did actually get this bondi sands like everyday gradual tanning foam i have tried the bondi sands like a normal kind of tan and it's so good and you can get it in being number 5.99 i did buy this for 5.99 it is it is donated to charity as well, which is really good. I've wanted to try this for ages, but I've always thought, like, face tan is quite expensive. Uh, but I do know that Bondi tan is really cheap in B&M for what it is. Because usually it's like £18, £20, which is a lot for, like, fake tan. But Bondi tan is my favourite ever brand of fake tan. Like, I love it so much. And it does smell of coconuts as well. So, I will be trying this out tonight, I think. Hence why I exfoliated my arms and legs. Because I don't think I've fake tan in a good few weeks and honestly like this morning as you've seen in the vlog i literally look so pale so i was like right 
I will fake tan my face and body tonight. So I did actually pick up a new tanning mitt. It's just like a Felvo tan one. These ones are 199. They are the best tanning mitts in the whole entire world. I always seem to break them. I usually get a, like a hole at the top of them. I think it's because I'm quite firm when I apply my fake tan. It always go like I always pushes through the like top bit but yeah these are like a velvety mitt and they are so cool and super pretty and really affordable so that is what i bought from b and um so yeah but i will be slapping on a little bit of makeup soon because the time is currently 5 to 12 and i do want to get a video film today um as tomorrow i will be going to scott's to do some baking as i'm currently working for him during lockdown um so um, my working days are usually a Thursday to so Saturday or Thursday to Sunday. But this week I'm working till, till Saturday, so that's like three days of work, which is not too bad. Obviously Valentine's Day was like a week and a few days ago now. And I did get a gorgeous bunch of flowers off Scott. And to be honest, like 10 days after, they're still like really healthy. So I just want to show you them because they're looking really pretty still. Here they are. Here these pink ones are still blooming. They're very healthy. A few of the berries are dying, but and the roses are kind of going a bit black now. But, but overall, they're still looking really healthy, like you know. And also, I did get a little um a, a tray for my perfumes, like a little gold one from Home Bargains for like four or five pounds. It is the best thing ever, like it's so pretty, and it actually fits on my perfumes on perfectly as well. Like, oh my god, like home bargains have some really nice like homeware in at the minute also outfit of the day i am wearing a nice top with some joggers as i usually wear and um, some joggers underneath when i will be filming um i will be changing out of this top once i film the video in case you're wondering this top is actually from h&m it's like a like a silky satin like top and it's cut out and like i've worn this loads in vlogs now but like it's just a really nice top to wear and h&m do h&m do actually have some really nice clothes like on the website at the minute so if you have a look head over there but yeah um i'm gonna sit down and do my makeup now because it's time to slap some of the good stuff on my face because i literally look like a child so it's not a good look so makeup is all done now as you can tell from like an orangey eye look with my like huge eyelashes because yeah i like to wear dramatic eyelashes but i will be straightening my hair now because here is my actual hair it needs straightened because um, my hair is wavy. The straighten is now heated up, so all I'll need is my little hairbrush and I'll just kind of straighten through and then I'll be done. And then afterwards I'm going to make some some lunch because I am feeling a bit hungry and this just had... And I did only have a banana for breakfast, so like I am still hungry from that because like it's quite light having a banana for breakfast. But I am going to just... Go through my hair with these now and then I'll I'll have perfect straight smooth hair. Um also I went on a walk a couple of days ago, a two hour walk, and oh my god, I woke up the next day and my legs and my bum were absolutely killing me, like so achy. I think it's because in lockdown I've been so inactive, I haven't been going on walks as much as I should do. And oh my god, my leg yesterday, like all day, was so bad, so I might go on a walk today, as we're going to B&M. I just need to get a few things for my sister's birthday. So I might walk down with my mum, but we'll have to go to Hobby Craft to go and collect a parcel for Scott. So I might just drive instead, but who knows? But yeah, anyway, I'm going to do the rest of my hair now because it just needs to be perfect and smooth. Who will find like straightening hair so boring and it, like, it just takes forever like it's just the worst thing to do it's just so like long and it just takes forever but yeah i'm gonna carry on doing this until it's all nice and even i'm having a pepperoni pizza for lunch who else loves pizza for lunch because oh my god look how good that is and i'm also watching a bit of loose women on tv because i'm an old woman like literally but yeah i'm gonna enjoy this now because i am actually starving and then i think soon and after this i'll actually film a video and then i'll be going to be there because i love being there it is my second home i've now filmed a video and i'm now about to go out to meet my mum as she finishes work soon so like i will be going to be in there and then we'll be going to hobby craft in the car afterwards oh my god why do i sound so weird um so yes that's, so that's what i'm gonna do 
right now but still have to get change out of these because I will, I will not be leaving the house wearing my joggers because like uh no I've been wearing them in the house for too much I've been wearing them in the house for too long so I want to get changed into, into some jeans or something else something comfortable anyway um so yeah but I'll go pack my bag I need to get all the things as well to bring with me and I'll be ready to go so for the I'm now home again honestly that walk timed me out like so much I was absolutely sweating as I am on my period and I do sweat a lot sounds disgusting but it's it's just hormones isn't it girls you know I did buy a few things when I was out I did buy a little something for my sister for like a birthday like she's turning into like a little cleaning freak like me now and she's starting to get a slight obsession with Fabulosa I'm so proud of her but I did actually buy another Fabulosa spray because every time I'm going to be in M, of course you'll find me in the Fabulosa aisle because like oh my god so they bring out some new scents like almost every week probably but I did get an Electrify spray because I do actually have this in the carpet spray and I used to have it in the foam spray and it smells of like perfume and like nice things so I'm just going to spray some because it does smell oh oh my god it just smells of like perfume that is so good so I will be using it to clean my room with as I do usually I like to clean my room every week and I like to alternate with fabulous sprays every week because I do have like a big collection of them but anyway I did also go to Tesco and there was something in there I've seen advertised on YouTube quite a lot lately and I had to get them as they were £1 if you use the club card or one that I know without so I was like okay I have a mum kindly bought them for me with her club card I don't, I don't have a club card but anyway I did get some Walker's Max KFC crisps I've seen it advertised and it also comes with a free meal as well like what <laughs> like I've seen it advertised on like Facebook YouTube everywhere um so I think I'll try them today because they do look very different for like crisps. I'm hoping that they'll taste like the real like thing if you know what I mean. But yeah, I think I'm going to try these out in today's video. But let's take a little thumbnail first. There we go. Ready? Let's try them. They smell quite potatoey. Obviously they are crisps but... I can't smell like a chickeny flavour to them, which is good. Oh my god, they actually smell really good. So this is what they look like. <laughs> oh my god. Wait a minute. They taste exactly like KFC chicken. I'm not even joking. Oh. <gasps> I'm going to enjoy these tonight, guys. I might even take them to Scott's tomorrow because they are so good. Oh, I left them out of bag for Scott's as well. Um, oh, my God. They, oh, my God. They are so good. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Oh, my God. I highly recommend these if you love KFC or chicken or whatever. They're so good. I did get some mini eggs as well because like I love my mini eggs you know I did, did I did have a full bag to myself yesterday because I was just like on my period you know just like hungry I didn't have a care in the world about eating, eating unhealthy yesterday so that is why I had them but yeah but anyway I'm gonna go hoover and dust my room because it is a weekly thing I like to do I will be getting changed out of this because I was absolutely sweating, which is disgusting. And yeah, it's quite enclosing here. And yeah, um, it isn't a nice feeling to be sweaty, is it? So yeah, not good. But yeah, I think I'll have a few more of those. I think I'll ask all my family to try one as well and see what they think of them because they are absolutely incredible. But yeah, I'm going to go and do my room now before it gets dark because the time is currently 10 past four so like the time is getting on now to be honest right here so i'm now gonna go and pack up my holes all i do have a machine of perfume a machine of hold all which i actually got when i bought a machine of perfume i'm actually wearing machine right now 
So I got changed into like a t-shirt because I was like a sweaty mess before and it's kind of disgusting. But I will be going to work for Scott for the rain day, for, wait a minute. So I'll be going on Thursday, which is tomorrow, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So I will need the three outfits. So I'm kind of thinking more lounge outfits because it is the time of the month and I'm feeling a bit like, ugh, that kind of bothered. So first thing I think I'll take is my PLT the leggings because I can wear them in the house, I can wear them to go out to be honest. Um, it's a pretty easy outfit. I've had these for ages so I'm just going to fold these up and put them in because they are very good and I do have a lot of period underwear because yes, I do wear like old ugly underwear so do not like judge me. I do have a lot of old Calvins and just like a big underwear because like, you know, like it's just, it's comfort isn't it? So, I'll just take all these to take, as I won't be wearing any pretty underwear this week, which is sad, but it is what it is, because these are massive, like, look at them, <laughs> they are proper granny knickers. Um, right, and then I'll just pack, like, socks and all the boring things as well, because, like, essentials, do you know what I mean? Um, and then, I'm taking a lot of jumpers, I do have um, a really cute, like, card jumper to show you from Zara. I think I have actually won it a few times in my videos but like you guys will love it because it's so cute. Like it's actually adorable, I can't wait to show you. But I'll just like place all my underwear in there. I'm just gonna show you it. Where is it? Oh it's here. Oh my god it's so cute like look how cute that is. Oh my god. Wait a minute. I want to try it on to show you guys um how it like works because like it is a very like a cropped cardi underwear thing and it's so cute. Look how adorable is that? I love this so much. Like, it's just uh, so cute and, and like it's really warm and cosy. I will be taking this cutie with me because I haven't worn it in a good month or so. It was a lot of money, so I want to make the most of it. So I'm, I'm taking this to Scott's because I can be able to chill in it. And to go with that, I do have a, a PLT, a boy suit to go under it. It's the right one. It goes with anything really so that is going with that outfit and then i do have a pair of jeans to take with me a really old pair of primark ones i'm in need of some new jeans asap because all of mine are getting like really old and like worn do you know what i mean and then i will be taking a plt jumper with me because it's like a vibrant but like i love this jumper and i do this where I do wear this quite a lot because it is like just like a coarse jumper and goes with like a lot of things as well. And then also, I will be taking a like sports bra with me. Like I said, we'll be trying to do some exercise while I'm at his house. So like a lot of walks, I'll be taking his dog deer is going to walk, I hope. I like sports bra, it is tiny, so hopefully I still fit into it. Um, A pair of joggers because I'll be wearing these at his house and i love my joggers a jumper to go over the sports bra and then a load of pairs of socks as well and then i'll also need some pjs to wear i love wearing a woolly fluffy pjs for bed and stuff so i will be taking them but so far the whole doll is looking pretty full right now me i will be taking a perfume i like to choose different perfume every week so I think this time I will actually go for, which perfume should we go for? The Alien perfume this week. I'll go for the Aliens one. Oh, it smells so good. Right. So more pads to go in there because yeah, it's that time again. It's that time. Um, the PJs, I do have quite a lot of PJs to choose from, but I'm thinking we'll go for like a darker pair in case anything happens, you know what. Um, if I've got any darker pairs, these ones will be okay. I'll go for these ones. These are quite old as well, so like in case I do have a bit of a leakage or something, it's fine. Um, I rarely ever do anyway, but it's in case anything bad happens. Always going to be prepared for the worst, you know, guys. So I'll take these because... I love my fluffy PJs and I literally just live in them pretty much. And then now, 
I will be taking some makeup with me and my hair straighteners, I think. But I will be using those tomorrow, so like there's no point in bringing them. Please, please ignore the state of me. I rarely ever have my hair like this in vlogs. Um, but I am about to fake a tan myself. I will be testing out this Bondi Sands Everyday Gradual Tanning Foam. I'm kind of nervous to use this only because like it is clear and I won't be able to have a guide of how it will appear on my skin. I do have a towel laid down on the floor because I have faked hand a lot of times. I have no towel on the um, carpet and I've ended up with fake hand on the carpet so I will be laying down a towel today also I do a bit of eyelash glue my eyelashes and eyeshadow which is fun. Oh my god, ow, it really hurts. But yeah, and then I will be using brand new fresh tanning mitt as well because there is a no better feeling than using a brand new tanning mitt. So here I go. I will um, update you on in a few hours probably. How long does it take to develop? It takes... Does it even say how many hours? Um can't see what it says but hopefully it will here in a couple of hours hopefully or maybe earlier um but yeah i'm gonna go and do this and i will update you all in a little bit hi you've just finished tanning please ignore the state of me i still have my hair up as i do have a lot of the product in the end of my baby hairs and it is really sticky on my skin so i want to keep my hair up i will be washing my hair in the morning obviously because it does look a bit greasy and a bit of a mess but overall, so far, it was very easy to apply. It smells pleasant enough. It doesn't um, really have a tan smell as of yet. But obviously, I did have to Google the development time because I couldn't find one here. But it does develop in around one to three hours. So I will wait and update you guys, obviously. Overall, it is very easy to apply. It smells all right. Uh, very smooth on your skin. Hopefully, it will not streak on my skin because i cannot be bothered with that but yeah um it's really good and i love it so far but anyway i'm gonna enjoy a lovely bag of so many eggs and i think i'll i'll light a candle as well because i just want to have a bit of a chill night tonight i did put the tan all over my face and body i mixed it in with a moisturizer on my face to kind of like uh, give my skin a bit of moisture um but yeah so hopefully it will actually show up on my skin in a few hours otherwise i will be disappointed but the main reason why i went for this is because with my fake tan whenever i wear it all my family judge me and call me an orange so i thought that i will go for like a gradual tan and hopefully it will be more of a natural look on my skin i'm going to have a little youtube movie night tonight so i'm going to start off with i will be watching a little bit of amber night and i do have these gorgeous crisps again because I'm telling you now, I'm obsessed. They taste of some fried chicken, KFC, and of course, some many eggs because they are addictive. Good morning, everybody. It is the next morning, and it, the time is currently 10 to 11. I did wake up at 20 to 11. So, I've only just woke up. I did have a bit of a late morning this morning, but um, I'm going to vlog a little bit of today as well as i'm going to scott's and i will be giving him his belated valentine's day present as it arrived a week after valentine's like how annoying is that like what but anyway update on the gradual tan i really like it it's really natural but you can tell that i've got a bit of tan so like I'm kind of feeling that, you know. It did take a little while to develop, but if you sleep with it overnight, it like it, it looks so good. But like on my legs, it looks like really like brown. Um, it looks really brown on my legs, but like I love it. But wait a minute, this won't be nicer. Yeah, <laughs> wait a minute. Look at this. It's really brown in real life. I don't know if it's picking up on the camera but it looks so nice but yeah um 
I'm gonna go and have some breakfast now as it is almost 11 o'clock so I need to get some food before this time uh, but yeah I will be going to Scots today because I will be doing a lot of baking for his business and I will be like and my role is to basically like uh, go to the shop for him and get the like ingredients if he's if he's run out of anything um like I clean up all the dishes for him and then say he's making a birthday cake or something and then um he's also got to make some cupcakes I will like make the sponges of the cupcakes if you know what I mean I'm gonna go I'll get some breakfast again I do have my morning voice again um <laughs> I don't know why I sound like this in the morning guys but I do <laughs> yeah it's fun but I am quite hungry so I'm gonna get some breakfast hair and makeup is all done now I do feel more normal Um, I do have a lovely pink uh, puff shoulder top on from New Look uh, I've had this for quite a while but I love it so much and um, I've gone for like a orange eye look so now I'm gonna take a few Instagram photos. I haven't, as I have not been posting like on Instagram as much lately. And then afterwards, I'll probably have some lunch and then go to Hobbycraft and Asda to put some petrol in the car and also to collect Scott's parcel. And then I will be on the road to Scott's house. So yes, like I'm gonna take some Instagram photos now and then I'll be on a roll. So exciting times. I'm with Scott and Daisy now. <laughs> Look. Hello everybody, hello. Look oh. you waved. Oh my god, you're a good girl. That was you, wasn't it? Was that you waving? Yeah. Oh. Who is it on the camera? Who is it? Who is it? Who's on the camera? Who is it? Who's that? Oh, oh look, she's probably looking at herself, long. <laughs> yeah. YouTube, nah. but anyway, so I've got a belated Valentine's Day present for you to open. Three weeks late. Two weeks late, actually. Oh. <laughs> I've been wanting to give you this. <laughs> and it didn't arrive in time. <laughs> Daisy, what are you doing? <laughs> if I don't open and show me what they're doing. Look at this. <laughs> Look, they got my face on. Fucking hell, that's big. I know, that's what I thought. <laughs> Do you like them, Daisy? Oh my god, look. Oh, oh please. I hope they fit you. <laughs> that's funny. It looks like bicycles. <laughs> Cycling shorts. Oh my god. <laughs> Do you like them? Oh, I love them. Can I wear them today? Yeah. Uh. Them. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Oh my god, I can't believe you got them. I didn't even have any ink when it was them. Thank you very much. <laughs> You're very welcome. <laughs> They're funny. You're gorgeous, aren't you? You are. Oh, look at her little face. She's very nosy. Oh no, don't do that. <laughs> Dude, what's this? Dizzy, stop. <laughs> Oh, look. Oh. Do mind? Oh, she's gorgeous. Oh. What, what's this? What's this? That's a baby. Oh, look at the little head tilting. Oh. Go get it. Oh. What is it? What is it? What is it? Oh. Okay, I'll play with you then. I'll play with you. Go on then. Go on. <laughs> Why is she being so cute today? Go on then. Wait a minute. Sit. Jump. Come on. Up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Go on then. Over there. Good girl. It is a lot later now. I'm finally made that. a cake. You always say that. Like, how amazing is that cake? I'll, uh, I'll, I'll turn the camera around and show you all because it is amazing. Yeah, how gorgeous is this cake? Like, looks different on the camera. Looks lighter, doesn't it? Yeah, but I'm, textural, like, artistic. Yep. Yeah. A concrete kind of look, isn't it? To it, yeah. it's beautiful. Proud of yourself. Very. Proud of myself as well. By the way, this is to clean the board. Isn't oh it? yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Lovely. I love it. All right, everybody. So, the time is currently twenty-two ten. So, like, it is quite. Latish now, um, 
Definitely. I'm gonna go and do some editing. <clears throat> and you're gonna do some um sleep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Replying to customers. Yeah. For cakes and everything. Always but, a fun job. Yeah, always fun. I'm gonna end this vlog here so we hope that you guys have enjoyed this video if you have make sure to leave a thumbs up a comment down below and please also subscribe to my channel if you are a new person watching this video and i will see you all in my next video